gonna bring it to the table. Boss talk. Where your girlfriend? Check it, check it, check it. This is Unique Host. It's your boy, ECEO, man. What's going down? Boss Talk 101, back in town, man. Listen, man, I got some dudes in there now. Man, it's gonna get real serious real fast, man. Just say no to Sco co-hosting this thing man, today. Uh, why would you do that? <laughs> why would you do some shit like that? <laughs> Sorry. And guess what, man? And guess what? It's AD back in the building, yeah, man. man. In Dallas, Texas, in Dallas, man. man. In the flesh, so, man. man we, we've been talking about yeah. this for a minute, too. I've been calling AD. I'm like, man, we gotta get you over to Dallas, man. Facts. We did the Houston thing. Shout out to my boy, man, uh, G Luck and B Don for letting mm -hmm. us get out. And then I seen him. He linked up in LA with y'all yeah. yeah. right after that. So that was hard, man. But man, thank you for coming on the show, bro. Oh man, I appreciate it. Thank you for having me, man. Yeah. Man. Hey man, yeah. I, I ain't been to Dallas in a while. I said, man, it's beautiful out here. You I love, love Dallas, it. man. Love it. You know what's crazy? Shout out to my boy. I ain't gonna tell you his name, but he was like, man, he said Dallas got it right now. Yeah. Yeah. In Texas in general, though. Yeah. But when he said like, he said Dallas got it, what are you talking about? What? Like what? He's just saying like the women. Oh, okay. That's what he said. Okay. You know what I mean? I'm gonna keep it real with you. Okay, yeah, man. See, look, when you from Dallas. You want to see something new, man. You know what I mean? But I'm that's like, that's like L.A. People come to L.A. Yeah. They're like, oh, man, the women beautiful out here. I'm like, nah. Yeah, yeah. see? Nah, she been around here for a long time. You remember, know what I mean? Remember growing up, the school you go to, niggas always be like, nah, fam. You know what I mean? The bitches at your school bad. But hell nah. Nigga, you know? the, bitches, the bitches at y'all school bad. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, <laughs> but you appreciate them here. later, though. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to be honest places. with y'all, man. You know, hey, man, your boy Snoop say, man, every other city we go, mm. we see the same old ho, mm. man. That's what he said, OG. Man, he said he see the same one. Oh yeah, cause the real sluts gonna travel. <laughs> Remember that? Yeah, the real, yeah. Yeah, real sluts travel. Yeah. Yeah. Or, <laughs> or you know they gonna do their thing and they gonna migrate somewhere else. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, do yeah, it all over. Yeah, yeah. Keep, you know right. what I mean? yep. man, man, you know, man, like man, like when you look at y'all show, man, and I see how y'all rolling, man, like it's dope, man, to see how y'all moving on the independent level. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like you ain't really seeing a lot of people that's moving on the independent level. You know what I'm saying? Most of these guys is under umbrellas, like you. You got your own show. Man, come on, man. You know how we do it. And, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm gonna say, your I'm gonna show say is your show. Bro, I'm fucked up, too. You know what I mean? I'm, <laughs> I, I, I'm seeking help, my nigga. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm seeking help, bro. Because my show is still unorthodox and Oh, it's shit. crazy. It's crazy. I gotta yeah. watch it. Yeah, well, oh, you gotta pull crazy. up. Yeah, pull I gotta up. do that. I gotta yeah, do man. that. You know what? I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this is where, this is where uh, me and you almost linked it. Is through Raven from Akita's Cookies from when when Dolph got killed. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. She works. She works on my show. She's one of my moderators on the show. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 And uh, yeah, I actually got my own cookie there now. Yeah, I got I got the wow. strawberry cookie. You know what I mean? Yeah. Makita's Cookies, man. I actually went out there interviewed them. The internet been dragging them folks, put them in the murder of Dolph. But I've been kind of you know what I mean? On that there. ain't they fault though. Man, nothing nah. to do with them people, man. Nah, nothing at all, bro. Nothing. So. I love the fact that you know they was they. I, I latched onto them when you linked me yeah. with them because yeah. they're a small business and they've been around forever. And that's hard, you know, to see that business have to go through that. So it made me feel like, man, we got to rock with them. Man. Hey, Just, it, hey, it it black people don't have a lot, bro. Niggas no. be acting like they got it, yeah. but these niggas be broke. Fast. So what I'm saying is we got to keep our businesses going, the small integrated businesses that we have. Yeah. We got to try to keep them going. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, there, I agree. So, so, man, what's up with the show, man? I mean, I see you over there killing the game, man. Like, yeah, man. What's the craziest thing you done seen here lately go on on that show, man? Man, you know, it's... It's a lot of positivity now, man, because we trying to, con like you just said, bro, as black people, we trying to conduct ourselves the right way now. Yeah. Like, we all come from the hood. Everybody know that shit. You know what I'm saying? We don't want these investors to be scared of us and stuff. We got a lot of sponsors now, too. So we got like seven, eight sponsors like all together right now, too. So we ain't trying to mess up no sponsor money, say something wrong. Just, you know what I'm saying? Mess up the bag and shit like that. So just being real professional, we getting ready for some more live shows and stuff, too. So um, our biggest show, I mean, our biggest venue, one of our biggest venues is the Novo. So we doing the Novo in um, November. Mm. I That's seen y'all did a live show. I seen y'all yeah, did, did a live show. The first one, yeah. two sold out. Yeah, the first hours. one is the one mm. I seen. Uh -huh. I'm like, yeah. damn. Yeah, yeah. So you on the level with it, bro. Yeah, yeah. we going to yeah. New York. We going to um, the Bay. And then 2024, we about to do a whole like little run, like mm. 10, 15 cities and stuff, too. So. You called me, I think, I, I remember you had went, you, you jumped on the internet a little bit, you was yep. in DR, and then you yep. called me from DR, <laughs> yep. you were in DR kicking it, yep. it was over there. he called me, I'm like, man, this nigga right here is in DR, man, I'm mad as hell, I need hey. to be over there. <laughs> Go it everywhere, fun, though. It? Oh, it was super fun, though, but, you know, now we trying to integrate everything, too, because I got I to gotta come down south, man, I got too got many two. people, our uh, third demographic 
is Texas. For that sure. watches us the most. Really? Yeah. And we don't never come out here, bro. We don't never do shows. We don't never integrate with the people. So I'm like, you know what? I love Houston. I said, I'm going to start coming to Dallas more. I'm going to start going yeah. to Houston more. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, and really yeah. fuck with the people, though. Hop on everybody's pods. Do that shit. You know what I'm saying, too? So, yeah. 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 I tripped off, man. I ain't going to lie to you. You know, the internet buzzing. I don't, I don't want to talk too much on too many things, <laughs> man. But you, listen, man. Listen, bro. Your name be ringing. That's all I'm going to say. I, I seen you on Joe Budden's show. You Shout know what I'm saying? Joe Budden, man. Joe Budden had you over there. He would, he, yeah. You know, the questions was going down. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. People trying to understand where you stand in the whole situation. Yeah, yeah, your yeah. whole, like, your name being spoken on. I can't say that. And, and, and to be real with you, when I talked to you about you leaving no jump, I was like, man, bro. How was it over there? You was being so nice. Oh, you was Mr. Nice Guy down in Houston. You were like, man, I just, you know, thank God for the opportunity. And then the next thing, I, I still feel like, like that, though. Then I yeah, see yeah. you the next time pulling out receipts. I only made $2,000 here. I made $2,000 here. I definitely make more than $6,000 a month. What was that about? I got to hear about yeah. that episode, yeah, bro. Shame. Like, you, yeah, why the hell you didn't give me that? You hey. could have brought the receipts to Houston, hey, nigga. You, you, know, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm one of the people where, I'm, 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 I'm trying to be, I try to be cool, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But the nigga in me still pop out of sometimes. You feel me? You frustrated? When I too. feel attack, I just, I just, you know, I just strike back. It's in my nature and shit, though. But on some <laughs> real shit, like that's all it is, man. Like, well, I mean, what made you bring the receipts out? Like, I know I heard the, I, I did hear the Boulay Kev interview. Mm -hmm. It was some shots fired, you know, all, war shots, all kind of stuff mm -hmm. were going on. Yeah, on that yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm just trying to figure out how do you move when, when, when your name being drugged through the mud, but then. It, it's a counteraction to where it's saying, oh, but you using our name to pretty much uh, uh, get views. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm learning how to respond to stuff. I'm just used to slapping niggas and shit. Mm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, right. and I know in the business world, that don't work. That no, don't it work. don't. So, it you know, and, 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 I, and I'm a grown man and I'm 34 years old. I should be able to conduct myself with words without having to resort to that. Now, if it's cause for that, then do that though, but I ain't about to let nobody have me crash out. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I got, I got my children. You feel me? There I got a go. great career. There I got go. a lot there of go. good shit going on. So if I'm a go, I'm gonna have to go for a reason, a not reason. for no petty shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Even doing the whole back and forth shit, like I'm done with the shit. But you let feel me, me ask I said you what I said. Real shit. Let, let me ask you this though: when you like, when you look at uh, Snoop Dogg, I remember the mm -hmm. Vibe Awards. You know, y'all don't, y'all young niggas, y'all don't know. I got yeah, the I ain't know they had the Vibe Awards. The Vibe Awards. Source Awards. No, the Vibe Awards, nigga. Nigga, at the same time. Same time. Let me tell you the Vibe. Let me tell you, it was what's that nigga name? The one that was on on race. Show that y'all the 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 producer Quincy Jones Quincy Jones, mm. Quincy Jones was pushing, pushing it right well, he was pushing the the, the vibe yeah, the yeah, vibe okay, thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so but Snoop Dogg they got into a fight in there I think with fifty of them got into a fight in there you mean, somebody you got stabbed you, you talking about you talking about Dr Dre with uh, yeah 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 yeah, 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 oh, yeah, yeah I'm just Dre was getting an award but Snoop was on stage but something Snoop said that was so detrimental during that time he say man if I'd have moved. 300 more niggas would have got into it, so I didn't move. And when you be talking, I thought about that. It's like some of the things you say and the world you come from could cause something to ignite. Oh, if you If you say things the wrong way on the internet, react to things a certain way, Niggas gonna move a certain way. And I still get blamed though. Exactly. <laughs> you know cause, what I mean? Cause, cause they can lock you up for anything. You said this or he said that and they tied together yeah. on these podcasts or wherever. Yeah. So. What do you do to try to keep the situation to a calm state, bro? Man, you, How do you do it? You know, just in, just in general, um, I done made it through everything. You know what I'm saying? From anything you could think of from a, from a gangster standpoint to a grown man standpoint, just I didn't get to this point just to go back to doing what I used to do or being affiliated and surrounding myself with negativity and shit too. So when my homeboys, I got people that really love me. They're going to yeah. do whatever though. You know what I'm saying? And it's only so much I can say where it's like, hey, bro, don't don't respond that way. Don't react that way. But when they at least come to me, what I facilitate to my homies and stuff like that, I got to be a real leader. Yeah. So I'm like, look, don't even come to me with no negativity. 
know what I'm saying? Unless it's in our face, we can handle it then. But if not, we ain't going to look for it. We ain't about to sit there and ponder on that. Let's go get some, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, little homie, you got you rap? All right, let's put you in the studio. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Bought a studio. All my little homies, y'all go rap. Yeah. Y'all go do y'all thing. Y'all need some help? You know what I mean, even like my little brother, man, my little brother got out of prison. 10 years, you mm-hmm. feel me? Yeah. He be feeling a certain way about certain stuff. Wow. You know what I'm saying? He was the hothead. Yeah. But, man, married, you know what I'm saying? He He's editing, shooting his own videos with an iPhone, editing them. He's making his own artwork. He's sitting there pushing. He's doing what he's supposed to be doing. And it's like, I'd rather see stuff like that yeah. than anything else. Because at the end of the day, all they're going to say anyway is, they some niggas. Yeah. At the end yeah. of the day. It's, 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 and, then, and then where does that put... Even even having Pushes that stigma, even having that stigma around me, they gonna get that bag to somebody else when they can say, you know what, he's a good businessman. He putting up great numbers. I've seen what that done in my rap career. Yeah, is when I'm going to labels and I'm sitting there with meetings and people telling me you a liability, and I'm like, how am I a liability? Oh, we hear some things. Are you affiliated with this? You affiliated with that? So a lot of doors was closed for me. Yeah, before I even got a chance to do anything. Mm-hmm. So now. I got a situation now to where it's doing great. I'm a boss. I'm independent. I'm I'm making shit shake. And we got black and brown brothers. We pushing together and shit like that. We got the city. Man, we got to conduct ourselves like businessmen now. Man, Pun is over there and he not. He, Pun don't give a yeah, fuck. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He don't talk like you. I should have got Pun down here. But Pun would have let that. He going to do it like you. Yeah, you look hey, bullshit. Hey, hey, you look Pun don't give a fuck. Pun would have came over here and shut it down. Hey, hey, yeah. But Pun also, though, see, one thing people don't know is that this is secondary for Pun. Yeah. Pun works for a for a big label. He been working for a big label. Wow. You know what I'm saying? But he still rock with you. Oh no, that's my that's my guy from day one. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Help help me get to where I'm at now. But he don't have to do podcasting. He's not in this for a check. He actually loves doing that. He has a corporate um label job. Wow. So no matter what the fuck he say, they gonna rock with him and shit like that. He's a boss of his shit as well too. So wow. yeah, it's bigger than what people think. They just think that niggas Yeah, just you know what I'm saying? They think all these niggas gathering streaming. up and they ain't they ain't doing shit and they yeah. got this going on. Like, nah, These niggas, bosses in the room. Niggas got motion, niggas, like different, different shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas ain't gotta throw it throw it in their face all the time. Yeah. But like, yeah, everybody know. Like talk real to me, shit. Talk real to shit. me about like fig immunity and fig immunity. community. Like like mm-hmm. tell me how this whole thing works. Like, like, how do you guys, cause I see you guys, y'all got a show where y'all kind of, you know, it's like three, you know, y'all, y'all have a little set down. Yeah. But y'all don't, y'all don't really invite, I ain't seen like YG on there. I ain't seen, I, I ain't yesterday. seen like the OT <laughs> Genesis on there like y'all used to bring on mm-hmm. No Jumper. Yeah. Like, what, when is that going to happen? Because y'all already together. Yeah. So this is, this is the thing. When it comes down to artists and I. You are artists. Yeah, I'm artist, but I kind of like how our fan base is, how it's integrated. The 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 everyday person has a chance of being a star to our people. They don't give a fuck about people coming over there acting cool, having egos yeah. and shit like that. They we leave the channel on there, they see that shit, it's gonna break them down right then and there. They're gonna say everything under the sun that you can think of. Wow. Every time. So a lot of artists they're not used to hearing the truth or they're not that used chat. to people making <sighs> yeah. yeah. They're not used to people making jokes about them and stuff like that. So yeah. And then a lot of people, a lot of artists ain't got no personalities like that. Yeah. So we like sitting with people that are, we, we actually got rapport with. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. People that we actually mesh with because then we gonna have a fun time. We don't wanna do the same hip hop questions. We don't wanna do the same shit that you can go to the radio station for. Come down here, you feel me? You gonna, you gonna laugh, you gonna joke, and you gonna be around your people and you gonna feel good and you gonna wanna come back. That's hard. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. kinda like yeah. your show is kinda set up the same as here. Like y'all go, y'all go live too. Right, yeah. y'all go straight live, and y'all right. just start. That's the way y'all both yeah. do the oh, yeah, same we both, type setup. So yeah. I thought that would be cool to just bring y'all. To oh yeah, the show. yeah. I'm, I'm gonna say, you know what? The thing about it is, man, I, I, I see your shit. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And they most definitely over there. He got a setting where he got people behind. You know, people in the, in the room over there on my shit. Right? Look, see, anything goes on my shit, nigga. I'm it's by rash, myself. Yeah. I'm by myself, nigga. He by, oh, yeah. he by yeah. yourself. See, look, remember, I'm doing a stream yard, so I just got people coming up with me. You dig? Uh, so anything goes. You know what I mean? Yeah. Nigga, be, nigga, been told me anything. Nigga, been told me go kill. You know what I mean? Whatever. You know what I mean? So. On, on the way we do shit, bro, is most definitely uh, similar to what you do. But nah, bro, anything goes when nobody's besides you. Feel me? Like ain't nobody in that motherfucker with you. So no matter what my opinion is, the next the next person have to, like a different opinion. 
nigga, they go off on your ass. We done cuss your ass out. Fuck yeah, you, nigga. Yeah, and it's, and it's I kill you, nigga. Yeah. All that shit is live, and you can't take shit back. You know what I mean? Once a nigga, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? nigga, oh, nigga, turn to a, a a goddamn gangster on your motherfucking ass on that show, nigga. So you gotta see together. it. You, no, gotta, yeah. you gotta check it out, bro. Yeah, you when you come to LA too, you gotta go sit down with us, man. I had Wack One Hundred on the show. I had Chris Mack on the show. Bosco One Hundred. Oh yeah, Van the Band too. Yeah, yeah. I was also hip hop. Hey, hey, I was a salute to Fifty Cent. You know, I was on hip hop homicides too. Fifty Cent, Mona. You know, you know, you know. I feel I feel for that too. Oh, for real, you did. The episode didn't come out though. Why? Which episode? Man, is my guy though. What happened? I I filmed for it though. But what happened? I don't know. I was waiting for you it to come. You ain't the first one. Mac down at, with, with, with Soldier Slim. Yeah, okay, yeah. Uh-huh, Max yeah. didn't come out this either. This shit didn't come out. No, nah, certain yeah, yeah. ones. They like, was they, asking me about like uh, Pop Smoke. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, so when yeah. So when they came, when they came down here and shit too, because, you know, I fucked with Pop Smoke. Yeah, like yeah. When he first came to L.A., you knew he him and y'all, yeah, y'all he rocked out. He Rest hit me peace. up. Like, before I even like really was tuned into his music, he DM'd me. He was just like, hey, what's up, bro? I'm in town. Like, I'm. he was doing everything the right way. Yeah. He was tapping in with the real niggas and shit like that. And then when I seen him, and the last time I seen him, it was in Miami. And they was out there deep as a motherfucker, just a, just a solid individual, bro. Wow. You know and what I'm saying? So wh- how did, he just said he, he linked with you when he came to town. Uh, and, and what did they say on the show? What was what, what, what Well, they was asking me like about the politics and everything surrounding that because like I just hate and I just said this shit on my Poffin show. I hate that everybody come to L.A. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And they get killed in L.A. All the time, bro. Yeah. It never fucking fails. L.A. niggas go to New York. You don't never hear no bullshit happening like that. L.A. niggas come to Texas. They come anywhere. Yeah. You don't never hear no bullshit yeah. like that. And it's just soon as motherfuckers come to our city, bro. It's just, nigga, it's always like that. Every time it happened, nigga make my stomach curl. Because yeah. yeah. it just pushes us back way more. Hey, man, he going far back. As, you know, it's Biggie. You know what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah, nigga, you know what I mean? P&B Rock, nigga. You know what I mean? So many See, cats. See, and P&B, the, another person you know I mean? yeah, who moved the right way in the city. I used to see him all the time. Used yeah. to be with the right people, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just hate, I just hate, bro, like, how my city is right now, the state of it, just... The robberies right now, like they wasn't robbing white people before. Now the white people, they Be- the white people. They going to Beverly Hills now. Damn. They taking Richard Millie's now. They they doing a lot of crazy shit in the they city. Tripping right now. They, they tripping on Rodeo. They tripping on Rodeo. They doing everything. Yeah, yeah oh, it's niggas crazy. Run, you gotta see niggas running out the store with clothes right now. I mean, it, it, it's crazy in the motherfucker. <laughs> they got that. <laughs> like, the Japan West Coast Canyon crazy. Mall, one of our one of our like nicest malls. Fifty people running in there. Uh, yeah, snatching shit. Snatch like, everything. Snatching grab. Snatching grab. Snatch Just grab. everything every day. Damn. Hey, I need to put a, together some shit like that out here in Dallas, nigga. What the <laughs> you feel me, right? <laughs> nigga, shit. I need to put together some snatching grabs out here in the D, nigga. Cause Cause it, it is crazy. crazy. I, 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 hey, they really get to it. Niggas, niggas getting to it. Because they got these new laws right now, too. So um, I don't know if they if they stopped it, but we had no cash bails for a minute. Really? Which was dumb. You know what I'm no saying? No cash bail. No cash bails and shit, too. And then. If it's not over a certain amount, you can't you can't really get in trouble for it no yeah. more. Ah, so that's damn. why everybody yeah. running. That's why niggas they running yeah. into the Nike like, store. Yeah, they running into Nordstrom. Yeah. 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 Ain't no ain't no trouble. Yeah. Yeah. Niggas yeah. hungry. Yeah, I'm, I'm hungry, nigga. I'm for the stuff. No, it's bad. I'm, I'm it's on, bad. Nigga, shit. This bad. bad. My nigga, money Moses. You did, my, my nigga, me and my nigga, money Moses. We slide. <laughs> no, shit. You niggas need to take these hoodies off, nigga. Money Moses is crazy. Oh yeah, I like it. I like it, man. I like shit. You know, you know. I thought about when when and I got to bring this up a little bit. The no jump thing when when he you know when the thing happened with you I look back at me I said really I alley oop because it really it does it does make people look at you but when you guys when y'all had the little old back and forth with me and Charleston yeah. him, it was like okay it's the same thing now because they like Okay, y'all ain't y- y'all ain't doing y'all got them little old 30, 40 views yeah. over there. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you. Hey, I forgot y'all niggas ain't smoke, bro. Yeah. I forgot it was smoke, my nigga. I show. I bro, real shit. I forgot it was real smoke. Shit. I did, bro. I forgot y'all but niggas was no, going at it, fam. Hey. Who won that shit, no, my nigga? Who won? Who won that shit? Let me tell you. Let me tell you some shit. But that's crazy. That's crazy how he shit worked, though, because it always come he back. Come right. back no, no. Just even like think about it. If none of that shit happened, I would. Wouldn't be sitting here right now. That's you real. Get what I'm that's saying? real. That's, that's a so put, real. That's what put boss talk on my radar. Because at yeah. first I was like, "Fuck these niggas." <laughs> and then I just started watching the content. I was like. <laughs> I was like, all right, man. Yeah, all right, man. Same as Charlton. I was like, I hate that nigga. Yeah. And then I started watching. I'm like, 
Man, this nigga funny as a motherfucker, but, but see, man. see, the thing you got to understand, when you basically was saying this, I was like, cool, you know, I don't have no many views, but them niggas got over there talking got millions. Yeah, I got them stirring up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But look, yeah. you, did, you did what you were supposed to do. Yeah. Yeah. You shake the pot, man. You make that shit yeah, shake but, but I, Shout out to, to Charleston, too, yeah, man. I just yeah, talked yeah, to him, too. Yeah, but I, I'm going to say this right here, man. The real thing I got to say about you is when you really, like, think about what you were doing, you still were defending, like, Boss talk. You were like, man, yeah. I'm not gonna talk about the boss talk niggas. You know, yeah, like you, no, you was the only one doing no, that. Yeah. Everybody else was like, f them niggas. Even 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 house phone were like, who is them niggas? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. But you all, you you kept it a solid, and I couldn't do nothing but like, man, that nigga. I gotta meet that nigga for real. Yeah, yeah. And you know, even when I when I finally talked to Charleston, it was the same thing. He was like, listen, bro, I wasn't even mad at you about certain shit. You said something bad about me on a white person's platform. Yeah, and I was like, I'm like, you right. Tell him, I apologize, I, bro. That was the reason he was sitting right here doing yeah. that Cap Phone News deal, and I was like, man, we gotta talk about this nigga. He talking about, yeah, you know what I mean? he set you yeah. up. I was like, wait, we gotta get some of that. We got to get some of that. Yeah, you know bro. what I'm mean? saying? Shout, shout out to him too, cause I, I don't want to spoil it, but he just did some real nigga shit for one of ours. You feel me? Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. for real, for real, man. Okay. The, the one thing I can say, yeah. man, about you is, man, I love your independency, bro. Like I said, you know, anytime a nigga getting his own bag, yeah. uh, but you know, let, let's talk about it. Just a breakdown. I don't want you to go into deep detail on yeah. the money, but what's more beneficial for you now that you have your own channel? Oh, bro, just that, that, that ad revenue and the sponsors. Okay. The sponsors is like, because they coming out the woodworks now and not just for our show as a whole, for each individual show as well too. So a lot of the sponsors that we have, we all have individually as well too. So okay. yeah, shout out to Mr. Mushies, uh, shout out to EPTM, shout out to Minimal, um, shout out to King Palm, shout out to, um, um, I'm missing some, I'm missing some, uh, Big Chief for sure. Oh yeah, for um, sure, you got yeah, chain yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, bro, just a lot of our sponsors, man, they just, bro, they take care of us, they yeah. believed in us from the get-go. When we made the transition, especially Minimal, Minimal said, look, here's the bag. Yeah. Y'all go get y'all, do what y'all do, get the equipment, run the shit up and do the shit the right way and shit too though. But yeah, these live shows too, man, that's a big part of this stuff too. Yeah, man, salute to the live shows, No, man. no, salute this to the one, motherfucking live that, shows. we did them first yeah. two, and we probably, the next offer was probably triple or triple or four times more than what originally what it was to sell the shit. So yeah, is that the new move, bro? I mean, far as like you see a lot of rappers Hell getting yeah. deals, you see a lot of niggas getting tours. Is that the new? A lot of comedians now it's the now it's the content creators. Now it's the cats. You, you know see what, what these niggas is getting right now? Aiden Ross and Man. these kick deals and shit. I just camera shit. act like they just got a hell yeah. of a deal. They did. Yeah. 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 They, they said. Yeah. Yeah. They, yeah. they said Aiden, Aiden Ross. Um, Got more than LeBron's uh, salary. Mm. Damn. Yeah. God damn. You can breathe. Little white boy over this bullshit all night. Nah, but you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta <laughs> think about it, man. You got the youth, damn. right? And the people, they're not paying just for the talent. They paying for their data. Yeah. So if you can have 50,000 people watching you every night. That's fifty thousand people that they can sell some shit That's to. That's right. So they getting that motherfucking data. It's crazy. Man, wow. What do you think is the next move to make you you guys go to the next level? Man, honestly, just more outside content, okay. more shows because the podcast side of it is cool. But all I wanted to do from the get go was try different shit as well too. So that's why the food show works so good. Yeah, and we got a lot of other ideas that we about to start filming the shit yeah. too. It's more expensive. But now we got it to, to film and do what we got to do. Yeah. But it's, those outside shows is, is important. It's important. Yeah, because yeah, that's the real content. You got to think about it. Like, how many podcasts do we do they have now? Man. Everybody million, got one there, right? Million. So what separates every single person from just sitting at a table, talking, yep. having topics, and doing that? It's the other shit. Yeah. You feel me? Yep. So it could be, nigga, hey, boss talk, go to eat. Go get some ribs from over here. Hey, Boss Talk goes over here and go venture and shit too. So yeah. I've been showing a lot of the vlogs just to see it and people are like, oh, I love that lane for you and yeah, shit yeah. too. Trying different things and yeah. doing shit like going to DR. <clears throat> I'm scared of heights. I'm I'm eating dinner in the sky. You know what I'm saying? I don't like that shit. Shout out to Sam Colder. He, them <laughs> guys figured it out real. I don't know if you know Sam Colder. 
But them guys, like, they travel and do different things and make it look dope and make it look live and they make money by yeah. just being niggas the that people travel. Yeah, and these people networks, see, so like you, these you networks just, will get, get, you know, pick that up. Yeah. Put yeah. it on their platform yeah. as well, too. So that's, that's dope. Crazy. That's dope. Because they see you. They already know you got talent. They, 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 yeah. they hear nigga music. They know what you would do behind this microphone. Man, they want to see how the fuck you live in. They want to see where you going. They want to see, you know, they want to see a nigga jury shopping. They didn't want to see any fucking thing. Just they anything. Anything. they no. just want to see your life. But that's why that vlogging is important, though. Yeah, you most definitely. Everywhere you go now, just, it's just get something. Yeah. Bring the I camera. just dropped my first vlog of the day. You see, I dropped my vlog. Me and Mo Three Son. I yeah, said, I, 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 said, I, went, yeah. I went and got Mo Three Son, the late great Mo Three. I went and got his son. Took his son out to do all kind of shit. I, I want to show people what I'm doing behind the scenes. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? A lot of things I'm doing to help a lot. Of, you know, a lot, a lot of different people in Dallas. A lot of fallen soldiers. A lot of rappers. So yeah, I feel you where you're coming from, bro. People see you talking, but they want to see what it, you know what the fuck you got going on outside. That's just that, that real personality there. and shit. Yeah, yeah. I, I think it's content over create. The same thing. Gary yes. v was, Gary V yeah. was doing that like early on. I love his movement where you can see everything. That Gary Vee was incredible yeah, he, he was I think he paved the way for a lot of us I give him his kudos because yeah. a lot of stuff I seen him doing I knew I would do in my own way yeah. and it was going to come off different because I'm a different color but at the end of the day it's still content you yeah. know what I mean yeah, most definitely, yeah. so Real shit. I think that's Real hard shit. bro like, nah, man. And, and so when I looked you up this time, I'm researching. You know, I seen when you was young, you and you and YG had a, your little beef when y'all oh, were in high sure. school. Y'all were yeah. high school beefing. You niggas really, y'all weren't gonna do nothing really, just real tough. Yeah, no, we was, we, was, we, was all, we was all some shit. It's crazy because I, I was I was with him at the concert yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Like that's my guy. But you know, it's it's kind of a similar situation of like why I'm here and you know getting to with Charleston and now me and Charleston cool. It's the same type of situation. Same thing with yeah. YG. Yeah, I, man. I, I told you, I always <laughs> what doing but, some but shit. How did, you yeah. was young. What made you go? I guess because you just, you, you were like 50 Cent. You just went with every, went at everybody. Yeah. That's, that's what, what 50 that's did. What, yeah. Just yeah. like, I'm going to just go at any nigga yeah. that's, yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Well, I Before <laughs> niggas was really game banging, we had clicks. Okay. In the city. And a lot of them clicks, YG was part of like the biggest click. Okay. And I was trying to come up rapping, trying to get a name for myself. So the niggas that I knew I was cool with, they were all together and then they split up. And then YG and his people, they were just dissing them. And I'm like, y'all niggas ain't going to strike back. Yeah. You feel me? So none of these niggas knew me. And I was like, look, give me a list of their names with everybody name on there. Yeah. Tell me something unique about them. I'm going to diss these niggas. You feel me? Yeah. So I went and dissed every single person on that list and put that motherfucker up on MySpace. How hard did you go on YG? Yes, in MySpace. How hard did you go on it? I... I said some shit. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck them niggas up. Yeah, yeah I said some <laughs> shit. But the respect came because he was the only person that dissed me back. Yeah. Oh, okay. So nobody else said nothing. No, nobody else said nothing. So he the only one had hard enough yeah, to say he was so. the one like, nigga, fuck you too, oh, nigga. nigga rap, so man. we start going back and forth and shit. Yeah. So this the early YG before the hit. This is this before, way before, way before the hit. Hey, yeah, way see, before the hit. Even, even when that happened, I'm going back and forth with him. We got mutual friends and shit like that. It was like some real problems, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he was the only single person. And then later on, he was the, like, out of our generation, the first to get a record deal. He hit hard. So when yeah. he got the record deal, I was like, oh shit. Yeah. It went up. I didn't diss this nigga. You feel me? I'm already on I'm the- never going to get that, <laughs> man. I'm yeah. never going to yeah. get that. Nigga ain't throwing me on the remix. <laughs> hey, hey, nah. I'm never going to come hey, up out of LA. I'm, I'm already on the wrong track. But, <laughs> but once he got signed, you know what I'm saying? I put all that shit to the side and yeah. I was just, hey, look, we need somebody because somebody that look like us, where we come from, got an opportunity now. I've got to give my full support. So just immediately, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I was just supporting him, supporting him, supporting him. Every time he dropped a song, yeah. album, I was—I mean, not album, but mixtape, was doing it. You feel me? And YG's one of our greats yeah, he is. in the city. Yeah. And then, you know, later on, we in the studio, and we just started talking about the past, and we was chopping it up for like like an hour. Yeah. Then he was just like, hey, I want you to listen to my second album. This is after his first album. His first album went crazy. That's a classic. Yeah. yeah. So he's like, I want you to hear this shit on my album. I said, all right, cool. I go to the studio, I go to the, um, to the lab with him. He put me on his second album. Wow. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so that was a fly. full circle moment. And yeah, then doing yeah. videos and us, and I'm like, that's my guy. Like, I don't care what nobody say about him. Like, nigga, that's my homie for life. Yeah, that's and, crazy. And same type of situation. I'm like, it may have started off a crazy way, but look where it led to now. And just to see 
yesterday. We chilling at the Beyonce concert. Yeah. I seen everybody it. talking about, oh, bro, gigging it. Yeah. Y'all doing y'all thing. You doing your thing. Why'd you doing this thing? He come perform. AD, what's up? And it's like, nigga, it just all came together Full at the end circle. of the day. You know what I'm wow. saying? The crazy <laughs> thing is, like, even with you being with Clover G's, yeah, and yeah. hanging yeah. with Flip Nim and doing Sound, all yeah, this yeah, stuff. It's crazy that, nigga, yeah. that, you know, like, everybody, it's funny how all these years go by and you guys still find a way to reinvent, recreate yeah. your whole yeah. image, come up with something that people can really look at and be like, damn, man, they doing this now. So it's really like y'all got a fan base, and so y'all just take them with you wherever you go, right? Yeah. Shout out to Flip, too, because he looked out for my big homie. Really? Yeah. Back in the day, OG Suicide, for sure, for sure. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah he salute, looked out salute. for him, for sure, yeah. for sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's my nigga. Yeah, salute to yeah, the whole Clover G. Oh, the whole Clover gang. G, man. Whole Clover the G's, the yeah. whole gang, man. Like, so... Even man, listen too. I got I got I got to give respect to uh, Paul Wall as well too. Hey, man. shout out to Bob, yeah, Paul Wall, Paul Beast, Wall man. man. He did a he did a song for me and did a video a long time ago too. Really? Like, yeah, look yeah. out for me, bro. Rob what Kardashian. Was the name of the song? It's called. It's, 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 we got a video too. It's called uh, Wide Open, something like that. Really, Rob Kardashian. You did so much, yeah, much bro. music. Oh, what about Rob Kardashian? You said what? Rob Kardashian. Let me use his uh, uh what's that car again? Uh, with the M. Fucked up right now. Maserati now. Nah. He let me use his yeah. Maserati yeah. Yeah. shit at the Maserati. time. Yeah, me and Paul Wall. So yeah. yeah, man. You and OT Genesis just did. You love it, or is it you love it? What's that song y'all? Oh did? yeah, you love yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. That's my brother, man. Like, like what? How he did over there sleeping right now. I know, but how did y'all come <laughs> together to even even do that? Like, you know, you know what's crazy is that everybody know us, bro. Like just two peas in the pod, bro. Okay. I wouldn't be where I'm at right now if it wasn't for him. So he showed me, bro, like. The, he was the first person to show me like it's more than just just the hood. It's more than these little four corners and shit like yeah. that. Like you need to go travel the world and like literally, bro. I would not be where I'm at if it wasn't for him. Wow! Like how yeah. did you guys even first link? Man, I met him when I was like 15 years old. Really? Yeah, bro. Just being at these parties and shit like that. He was a part of this group called Fans. That nigga yeah, the best crook walker the party, yeah. in the whole oh, yeah, LA. He always been in like LA. that. For sure. Ain't no nigga messing nah, with that nigga crook walk. Nobody's yeah. crook walk. Yeah. That yeah. nigga come out with that crook walk so hard, I be like, this nigga crazy. So y'all was throwing the parties and shit, huh? So we would go, we would, like like I said, they had clicks and shit. Yeah. So the, his click was called fans and shit. Yeah. He was part of these niggas that, you know what I'm saying, his homies come in, yeah. the R&B music come on, yeah. and his homies are trying to dance on the bitches and shit like that. Yeah. You feel me? I didn't like when them niggas came up in there. You know what I mean? I wasn't dancing to the R&B music up. and shit, you yeah. know what I mean? Like, I know exactly what type of nigga you talking about. Shit, you know I, know exactly, I know what type of yeah, nigga you talking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, no, the genuine grinding on, on the outer hole. Him and his shit. homies and shit. Get, you, just, you, you talking to a bitch for two, three hours, and now this nigga, <laughs> him and his homies come over I'm there, about, shirts off yeah, and shit. Yeah, that type you of shit. Snatch your thing, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, nah, but we linked up um, later on. We had a mutual friend, RPG5, that passed away. Okay. And my baby mama ended up taking him home because he had a taxi and shit. And then the next day, he invited me um, to the Roosevelt Hotel, which is a very nice, hotel. expensive hotel. And at the time, like where I come from, my neighborhood, like it's a lot of internals and stuff like that. So you grow up, like you watching everybody. The closest person to you be the person that do you in. So when somebody too nice to you, you kind of like, ah, oh, this nigga might be trying to get me and shit like yeah. that too. So yeah, he invited me, him and his brother invited me to the Roosevelt Hotel. I went there. Man, we having drinks, we having food. I ain't got no money in my pocket. I'm like, damn, I'm, I don't even want to eat because I'm like, man, I can't afford this shit over here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Maybe the French fries, but not everything else. So I'm like, I'm like, I don't know, man. And and you a big nigga too. So bro, you, that's you, what I'm saying. Yeah, you, you, you like hell nah, nigga. We they like, like trying to stand me up. And they like, oh, they like to drink. I'm like, I'm yeah. like, I ain't trying to drink too much. I, you feel me? And yeah. then, man, took care of the bill. And I was like, what the fuck? Then the next day, they was like, we come back tomorrow. Come back tomorrow. I'm like, he's kicking it. Yeah. And I was like, why are these niggas so nice to me? I, ne I didn't get it. Yeah. I was like, why are these niggas so nice to me? I'm like, maybe it's some, maybe it's something though. Now yeah. I'm paranoid. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. thinking like, what they the fuck is- They trying to play me. They trying to get me. They trying to, yeah, they trying to line me up. But man, nah, it was just, was just genuine, bro. Wow. And then I started going to the club with him, bro, maybe five, six times a week. He like, look, this is how we gonna make it. We gonna go to the clubs. We gonna do this shit. And the DJs will let him perform every single night. I would be with him and I started building my relationship with them. And wow. you know, Buster seen him in the club, signed him. Signed him. Wow. Yeah. Mm. That's hard. Legendary. Man. Legendary. I remember when that happened. Legendary. Too. I was like, this nigga owned oh, the Buster. Oh, and he delivered too. Yeah. Before, listen, before Coco came out and he got that check, oh, we was wild. <laughs> I was I was scared, man. Mm. I was super scared. That's the way it be, right? That body nah, came fast. Cause no, cause 
We going to the studio. He ain't working. We partying. He ain't even. He ain't, he even ain't working. working. I'm like, bro. We going ten minutes before the club is ending. He want to buy Don P bottles and shit now. And I'm like, bro, as a friend, I'm like, hey, bro, you, you tripping? tripping. Like, you, you coming or no? I'm like, I'm coming. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. But nigga. I gotta, I gotta tell you. And we then, gotta work, man. I remember one time these fucking uh, engineers. They told the label, like, he ain't working. They're like, where's the music? Yeah. They're like, he don't work. This nigga don't work. He, he don't, don't work, he don't don't work at all. They, <laughs> they switching out the engineers. They like, y'all, something wrong with y'all, right? And then he dropped Coco, and it was. That's it. That nigga said, I don't he need knew too many, he could do it. That nigga I don't need I too many. I was so mad I missed the video, too. Did he Being know? late. Did he? Oh yeah, that'll get you every get time. I didn't know. He, I didn't he know. had the real cocoa there too, right? He had iced tea in there, right? Was oh, was, the real, was the real cocoa? Nah, there? bro. That, it, it was in a. It was in a Hispanic. I think Coco was in that video. Really? Coco no. was in the video. No, no, maybe the second version. Maybe the second I'm talking version. talking about okay. the OG version. Yeah. When they like in the little trap okay, house okay, and yeah, shit yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Like it was him and his brother. Yeah. I was supposed to be the third nigga, and I just and came late. Even make it. I ain't even listen. When I first heard the song, I I didn't think it was like it goes, that. that. I don't think me or him knew that, bro. Oh, he went. Stupid through the roof, man. Yeah. Through the roof. I, I, yeah, he had a couple of motherfuckers. No, yeah, he, 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 he ain't never dropped the album, bro. That, Still that's to this crazy, day. nigga. That's no album, nigga. Singles, nigga. Singles, bro. That's crazy, nigga. A single, nigga. He just, hey, nigga, nigga. Deion nigga saying everybody single, nigga. going yeah. there off on his stuff. Yeah. Still. That hey, nigga, that's, yeah. Khaled bought him out last night. At the Beyonce concert. You see what I'm saying? No, I need that. She just hit right for it. My real shit. Hey, and yeah. look, and, and when was you there, bro? When that nigga OT James, when, when, when he knocked my nigga DDG the fuck out. Was you, was you, you, was you oh, there? Man. Man. Was, you, was you there? Shout out to DDG. Oh, oh, damn, man. I was, I seen that. What the shout hell? Shout out to DDG. He was explaining man. it. I seen that nigga explaining the knockout. Shout out to shout out to shout out to DDG. What the hell just happened? That shit, that shit, you know, that shit got squashed, man. Yeah, yeah, I seen it. I seen it. Yeah, yeah. We were we seen um we seen DDG in the club. And bro, like we we chopped it up and yeah. shit like that. Just once again, you and he another black man, nigga yep. respect what he doing. Yep. You feel me? And when it come down to this internet game, bro, he paved the way for oh, a yeah. lot of people too. Oh yeah, most definitely. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, so absolutely. 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 Yeah. Absolutely. 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 I heard one person say, and I got to go back to this, you know, <laughs> can you niggas get a million views? I mean, yeah, if you, I mean, because it's something to think about. Yeah. You know, I done got a million views on the show before, but I'm just saying, how far will you go to get views? I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this. I need both of y'all to explain uh, oh, this no, to no, me. No, no, I'm, 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 I'm going to get with you. I'm right here, right? I'm in DFW, Dallas Fort Worth, <laughs> the home of Charleston White, right? Nigga, I'm not going as far as that nigga going. <laughs> I'm going to keep 1,000 with you, baby. If, if I got to keep a Batman belt on and just pray that another nigga don't got a pistol, like, I'm not going that far. Like, at the end of the day, I feel like I'm not that type of nigga. My content don't really come in with no shit like that with it. But some niggas would jump out the window for it. You feel me? And Charleston White is one of them niggas. He entertaining. He funny. You know what I mean? But that nigga jump out the motherfucking window window for some views my nigga but listen, like, wow. but you, gotta, you gotta think about what Charleston doing though bro the nigga is really undefeated bro oh most definitely he going everywhere most he definitely, just, yeah. listen he just went and Wack Wack is like look Wack is like I don't even fuck with him but nigga he 3-0 when Wack he went to Arizona wow. like, like nigga went out there everybody saying certain say shit this. I don't know about the Arizona shit though we gotta debate the Arizona no, shit no we can't debate the yeah, Arizona yeah, shit we gotta debate the Arizona Why? shit it because was, was it staged yeah, I'm gonna say this I talked to Nick look, I don't I think it was staged I, 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 wanna say, I wanna say this I wanna say this Okay, I want to say this. I talked to the nigga. Uh, what's the name? Sway. You Sway did have him on your show. I talked to that nigga. I thought, nah, well, this is what I did. I called him, right? I just called him just on some, like, what's up type Twitter? I talk. The nigga told me straight up, like, some, like, hey, man, like, we had to do what we had to do. Like, you know what I mean? Like, we couldn't fuck it up. It was a certain thing. We had to stick to certain shit. I couldn't do this. I couldn't do that. We got our money. That's, that's how he broke it. Now, I'm not, look, I want to say this, though. I want to say this, though. That's positive. If niggas want to do some WWE shit, fam, I'm with it. Yeah. I don't think niggas no, no, have to no, die no, and get yeah, beat yeah, up. No, you don't love live. and hip hop. A lot of people stage shit, make it look good for the entertainment, for the money. So I'm not saying niggas got to really beat the hell out of each other and whoop each other and chase each other down for real. But I just feel like you know some of the shit, like you know when it comes to you know the the the, the, the f certain niggas or the dead niggas or the man, bro. I know a lot of niggas out here in Dallas. They, you know what I mean? They, they, you know what I mean? Yeah, they they be wanting to see niggas, but yeah. But it's Charles the White, a smart nigga. Yeah, do he say a lot of shit that makes sense? Most definitely, fam. But I know.
How far are you willing to go for views, Go. That's all I asked you. I didn't ask how, you about how, all that. How far? How far are you willing how far to go? Willing how, to should a, how far should a person go to get these views, man? I'm gonna say this. I'm Stay say authentic, this. man. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna say uh, don't 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 sell your soul, nigga. Know exactly. what I mean? Yeah, don't sell your soul. Don't make it to the point where you can't even go to the goddamn grocery store, nigga. Yeah. Don't get no guards and shit. Don't, get, don't make it See, to the point where you know, don't, 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 do a, don't do the expense that it's gonna compromise your safety. There we go. You okay. feel me? Or at the detriment of your family and what you got going on. Yeah. Because that's seen, what you gotta. You know what I mean? I that's seen what I think you about. do something. Yeah. I don't know if you. I don't know if they planned it or what. What? It was like a dog or something came up behind you and you went for the strap. Oh. I'm like, did this nigga just stay something? Like it was. A, he was in the studio, right? And he turned around. He went for the for the blizzard. Yeah. I said, what the hell going on? They did for the shoot the dog. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> oh no, they was playing the prank on me. Yeah, yeah, he, he went for the content. That no, was good content. Good, good content, content, my though. nigga. Good like, content. How how far, like how far like like are you but willing see, to, even, how far are you willing to but go? See, even shit like that, like that's fun. You feel me? Yeah, that's fun. That's yeah. fun. That's like fun. that don't hurt nobody. Somebody could have got hurt, AD. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> don't react. The dog, the fake dog, could have got hurt. You know what I'm saying? Huh? No, but the 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 fact that now like we look at certain shit, we can laugh about it. Ain't nobody hurt. Everybody yeah. can go home and there's no hard feelings. You feel me? Then it's cool. But like once it gets to a point to where it's like, nigga, like you said, you can't go to the grocery store yeah. or you got to look behind your back yeah. for shit like that because let's keep it real. Ain't nobody not untouchable. Right. Yeah. It's, every dog has his day. Somebody can find you. Something going to happen. You could piss off the wrong motherfucker and then too, is, is these likes and views worth your life at the end of the day? Because they have some guys that are... Uh, uh, that was from our city. And they they were like being super disrespectful. They was dissing the dead. You know what I'm saying? Mm. They was going to different neighborhoods. They was dissing dead people from the neighborhoods and they was getting a lot of attention. Yeah. One of them ain't here no more. I remember that wow. shit. Yeah. I, mean, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah. 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 So that. it's like, and there was a lot of people that's trying to that tried to follow behind that. And it's like, listen, it's gonna be a lot of dead niggas, bro. Yeah. If y'all if y'all moving like that, like, that was some goofy shit. It's some I goofy that shit. shit. That it was really some goofy is, shit though. that nigga yeah. was doing. That was some goofy shit. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So niggas are willing to go all the way out. You know, they, they, they sell their soul. I'm gonna say, hey, I'm gonna say, look, Bray, look, Bray. It's, 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 you know, you see, like I said, you see a lot of niggas coming home from prison. You see a lot of niggas doing interviews now. People feel like the internet is for the streets. You see what's going on at No Jumper. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? They got Adam Twenty Two, got all the gang bangers around the crit, the, the, the what's the name? Brick babies. Well, uh, you know, he niggas. started that though. He was one of the first niggas. <laughs> no, we gotta blame this nigga for it. Yeah, he was yeah, one okay, of the first. Nigga for it. And he okay. didn't want to <laughs> take that. I told that nigga to take that down in Houston. I said, look. I said, you don't think that you being over there was a sense of security? You was you was really feeding the monster. Yeah. Let's be honest. So like, like you got black eighty for yeah, niggas, but niggas on the fuck with no jumper. Over there, swinging and banging with niggas, fights <laughs> popping off. I said, this is an interesting so, show. But no, but but that's just. That was me just being authentic. It wasn't for no views. It wasn't. Yeah, I know it. You but, you, me? but now it could turn to something else. It can. It but, but I'm a I'm a real like politician. Everybody yeah. know that about me. So I can do certain things and I can keep certain shit cool. Yeah. Because a lot of motherfuckers know me and respect me all across the board. So it's a difference when you a nigga who don't know everybody. If you don't got respect like that, yeah, you gonna offend some people too. And in, 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 in L. A. Bro, like. Bro, everybody know where everybody stay at. Everybody knows somebody that knows somebody. Like, you're not going to be able to run. You're not going to be able to hide. You feel me? If you want to go outside, you want to be comfortable and shit like that. Like, this shit ain't worth it, bro. It really Let me ain't. Ask you, did, okay, with the whole schism, I know with with you and No Jumper, y'all not y'all not rocking no more. Ain't going to be no reunion or none of that stuff, I don't think. You niggas ain't going to do no reunion. Yeah, all that reunion talk is not happening on either side, but... Um, just the fact of the guys who work over there now, like, does that put a wedge between you and those guys? There's no. some guys, Brick Baby, uh, Wag One Hundred, yeah. Crip Mac. Crip who Mac. Else? Well, you got who else? else? It's uh, a bunch else of over there. Uh, Sharp. Sharp. Yeah, yeah. You gotta Sharp, look yeah. like, is it? Is there a wedge there, or do you nah, guys y'all see each other and it's cool? Or is you seen you see what Wag just did? He had your shirt on. He, he, nephew, put, give me a t-shirt with your face on. I'm yeah. wearing on there. Yeah, I'm gonna show you love and stuff like that. I knew Brick Baby. 10 years before all of this shit yeah. too so okay that's a real nigga like I'm, we we don't we it's separate yeah. we separate okay. all of that cuz at the end of the day he out getting his money he's doing his thing how he got to provide for his family i can't hate on that 
So no matter what the fuck is going on, like I don't look at anybody that's over there like, oh yeah, y'all the enemy or anything like that. I don't even look at the nigga like he the enemy either. I don't care. Well, you okay, me? so yeah. so that bring up another point. I mm-hmm. I come to LA often. I yep. frequent. I, I last time I was there, I reached out to you. I reached mm-hmm. out. Nobody answered. It was a long while back. Yeah, okay. I reached out to you. I reached out to No Jump or Adam 22. This is when y'all were breaking up, too. Yeah. I didn't realize that. It was in the mix. Of all this shit. The mix. Yeah. I didn't know, though. I'm just reaching out to all y'all because I'm going to interview every damn one of you. Yeah. That's what in my mind. I'm thinking I'm for the interview. You know, you're smart. House phone, all yeah. that. But it wasn't no pro- I didn't know nothing about the You beat. know what was going on. I'm mm-hmm. just trying to interview some niggas. I'm like, I'm going out here. Yeah. I'm going to interview these niggas, and then we're going to figure out, you know. Didn't happen, but if I was to interview Adam now, would would AD still be cool with with Boss Talk One Hundred One Hundred Percent? You see, yeah. listen, see, and that's you see what I'm saying. And see, look, that's yeah. the thing. That's what the maturity and the growth is as a person, bro. You a content creator. I'm a content creator, bro. We gotta do what we gotta do. And if yeah. I looked at you like that, I'm a bitch ass nigga. Yeah, yeah. straight up. I agree, yeah. bro. I agree. Yeah. Why would I, mean? I hate on something that's gonna better you and better your platform? Yeah. If it's a good opportunity for you, do that shit. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I'm that's, not saying I'm kidding. No, 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 no. That's, 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 that's what he's saying. But bro. That's, no, no, that's, that's, that's what he's saying, bro. He got the way he's on the phone with the white boy. That's why I told him he's going. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think I've ever interviewed him. That's why I can't believe you, nigga. I have no relationship with him. I don't believe this nigga. That's why I told my uncle to suicide to stay over there. Yeah. I said it's a good opportunity for you. Stay over there. Do what you got to do. I'm not tripping on that shit. He's still over there. No, I don't know. He left. Yeah, he had the little. He couldn't deal with it. He couldn't. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I remember that. Yeah, uh, yeah. Well, he didn't like the back and forth that we was doing, so he was like, "He can't. He can't. He can't stay there, man." It's it's quickly, you know. uh, It's quickly becoming a thing where the community community is their own separate entity doing their own thing. Mm -hmm. Um, Did you? When you was questioned, when you seen the question about getting a million views, how did that make you feel? Just want to work harder. Make you hard. It motivates you. Yeah, it motivates you. Because you got to think about it, bro. It's only been six months since we started our new channel. Yeah. Man. You know what I mean? It's growing so, like crazy. Yeah, over there, so, my nigga. yeah bro. So it's like, yeah, give us a year, give us two years to really make this shit shake and see what we can do, bro. Because you got to think about it. We starting from ground one. Yeah. yeah. At one show, and we don't want to just just throw a gang of shows in the mix and just do certain shit. Like, if we can have five, six, seven, eight effective shows that's just doing what the fuck they're doing, of course the motherfuckers are gonna come in. The M's is gonna come in. Like, I ain't never look at that shit like, oh, you can't get it, or yeah. like, it's not gonna come. It's gonna come. Like, nigga did that shit with music. Nigga did that shit with our own channels. Nigga's gonna do that shit again, bro. That's what it is. No, I believe can't in this nigga. Look, I'm gonna say, say this. I'm gonna say about this nigga. Look, this nigga finna take over. You don't see what the fuck going on here? <laughs> now, I can read through this nigga, fam. I see what the fuck is going on. It is. He was over there. Then he peeped what was going on and shit like that. The nigga you know, went off on his own and then it's like, nigga, stop right. I'm finna run this shit up. And, and I'd rather, I'm be honest with you, man. I'm not knocking. I'm not a racist. You did? I'm not. That's why I didn't want to really. I, I'm not a racist. I was gonna bro. bring my, I was gonna I was gonna bring my wife over I'm not gonna deal with this because it's gonna look like three niggas talking about. Nah, you racist, my nigga. No, yeah, 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 you're racist. I was gonna bring my white old boy. You You know I'm older, so it it cut different. You know what I'm saying? You from the south too? Yeah, yeah, and I'm really from the south. But I'm gonna say it like this, man. I got a lot of white homeboys. I I ain't gonna lie, you know. Me too. Yeah, but at the end of the day, but I do know that there are boundaries that you can't cross when it comes to our people, man. Most definitely, I can't, and I can't disrespect. But we, we've come a long ways, bro. But we still got a long way to go. Long way to go. You know what I'm saying? So I can't really play with that. And you can ask your daddy about it. You can ask your cousins about it. Yeah. Your old uncles about it. They're going to tell you, man. And that's why it's important for us to work on ourselves every day. Yeah. yeah. And don't don't let the stereotype of, of who they think we are fuck up what we got going Most on. definitely. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Would you, would, I mean, are there people, who would you like to interview? Like, who would you like to bring on the show? Cause I, I, you know, people pulling up. I'm gonna sit in that back room. It's a lot of blue in there. I'm gonna be sitting in the back. Me and no, you Scott. coming? Yeah, me just say no. You scope. coming? You, you coming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. In L. A. Yeah, 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 you gonna buy it? No, no, we definitely, we definitely gonna get you some big shit. I'm gonna be back to big smoke. That's all I'm doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's me. Just say no to scope. I'm about to blow it. Honestly, bro, it's just a lot of dope. Like, it's not really artists. You know what I mean? Like a lot of comedians and shit like that. Like just to sit down with Joe Budden, just to sit down with academics. Yeah. The people are in the field that I'm in, that was dope. And you know, Gilly, that's my guy. I was on tour with Gilly before. Oh, yeah. So I want to sit down with Gilly and Wallow for sure, for sure. I know that's going to happen. Oh, yeah, most definitely. Uh, eventually. Uh, my guy, DC Young Fly, that's my guy right Wait, there. Wait, academics been yeah. over there? 
To where? To, he ain't been over there. To Not yet, but he coming though. He is. I'm going to New York next week to pop up on him too again. Okay, yeah, yeah that's he gonna got, be live. He's starting. He's starting his uh, team right now. He got some shit called Academy coming out. Really? So they launching the next week. I'm going out there. He having a live show too. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, hard. Bro. And he got he got that. You got to go to New York and, and fuck with everybody out there, bro. Yeah, the I podcast had, shit out there is. Well, you is know, different. I interviewed I interviewed Ice T at his house out there. That's fine. But so we going to New York or what, nigga? What we yeah, doing? Yeah, we going right, to New York, man. Know. I fly to I, I love New York to be honest. I just yeah. come back from Rhode Island yesterday, right, nigga. Yeah, I'm tripping. I be out there, nigga. I be out there. You know my ass in New York, nigga. You been in New York? You been in New York before? Yeah, no, I never even been out to New York besides one time back in the day on some music. Type shit, and we went there, did a venue. You know, you know how that rap shit go. Yeah, you go yeah, out there, yeah. you got a hotel, do the hotel yeah, venue. You ain't really seen what's going see on. Shit, yeah, got the fuck up out of there. So yeah, I most definitely want to go on just some post up chill shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, real yeah. time. Yeah, I've never been out there just to run around New so, York. I need to. Because when you when you think about it, man, like like there's these these the third coast, of course, the south, uh, east and west coast. You really got to make your rounds, bro. Yeah. So so yeah, cause Carlos Miller and them be on here. Y'all mentioned them a while ago. Mm -hmm. And to be honest with, they show does great, man. Oh, like oh. them bo them boys. When I seen playing. them get the Netflix special, man, I was oh, they super proud. That too. Man. Chico just left here. Yeah, I love yeah, it, bro. Like, see, I like seeing shit like that. Yeah, you know what I mean? Just so just building that product and, and making it on a national level. Like, what do you fire. think when you see them down there doing what they doing? Like the eighty five South. Oh, bro, that shit's amazing, bro. Just getting those certain moments and it's authentic and the way they do their shit, yeah. they one of a kind. Can't nobody do what they do. No, yeah. no, you no. know what I mean? In DC, man, I met him. I met him actually in Texas for a trade day. Really? Back in like uh, Ace Town. Ace Town. Ace Town. Ace Town. Ace Town. That's big bro right there, yeah, man. Through the trade. Um, I went to trade day in 2000, I want to say 17. For the first time, yeah. nigga had a camel in the park. Going hey, there, I was yeah, like, yeah. yeah, I was like, what the fuck? Nigga going to. No, I met DC Young Fly. Um, I met DC Young Fly there, and then we was just cool, bro. He put me on his album. You know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. he can rap too. People get the shit. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He can he, rap his and ass. And he gonna off. sing a little bit. He had a bang with Mo. He had a song with Mo three. You know what I'm saying? Mo three. Yeah, he did. Mo three was hard. Man, man. he yeah. was nice. Well, man. you can't get away from Mo three. This the, when you, you can go back and listen to that right now. It ain't really much touching that. He bro. was nice. Yeah. You can go right now and listen to Mo three, and you are gonna be like, damn. See when niggas start reaching the West Coast. Then it's like, all right. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. people yeah. fucking with it. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're right. Yeah. But, but, yeah. but who, like, when you think about just the music right now, when it comes down to the West Coast, because you love the music, like, who's popping mm -hmm. out there right now? Like, when you. Oh, bro, it's a lot of. Hey, shout out to the homie Mark Nasty. You know, he okay. said he's on the team with us. Uh, 310 Baby, he got one of the hottest songs in the club right now. Baby. Um, you got Blue Bucks. Uh, shout out to Ralphie the Plug. Shout out to, uh, to Rucci. Um, it's a gang of people out, out, out doing their shit in the city yeah. right now, man. I love to see that shit, though. Yeah. For real, yeah. for real. Yeah, yeah. like, like it, uh, and do they come together? You know, we have an issue. No. That right. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We have issues, too. Yeah, it's like, my nigga. Every, every, see, and that's just us as black people, bro. Especially in music. A lot of, and I ain't gonna say this everybody, but a lot of artists think, like, if I give him the opportunity, if he gets the opportunity, it's gonna fuck up the opportunity. See, when I used to go to label meetings and shit too, they would ask me about artists yeah. that were, you know what I'm saying, similar, you know what I'm saying, status of me. Yeah. They're like, hey, what you think about him? I'm showing love. They told me, like, you the first person that showed niggas love. They showing love in these man. offers. Niggas <laughs> dissing. Nigga dissing they, shit out, they nigga. dissing their friends. Because yeah. they thinking that that opportunity may not come to them and shit too. Yep. So, yeah, man, we, we need to get away from that shit. Nah, and, real and, shit. And everybody's moving to be stronger if it was together. I got a question, man. Yeah, uh, I see you smiling. Look, yeah, the devil, the devil yeah. is smiling. Yeah. What you about to say? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. I mean, if, if, you know, I've been seeing niggas getting in the ring. You know, celebrity. Oh yeah, boxing. yeah. Mm. So I'm down for all that. You and uh, you and Adam Twenty Two. Uh, like, oh come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bro. Come on, man. 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 Come I'm but, being real. But they the everybody work their problems out though. This bro, is the way it's supposed to go. This is how I work my problems out. <laughs> like, like, like would you, never would you be willing to do it with anybody? With anybody? I mean, if, if it make if it makes sense, because there's been a couple of people where they like see me going at them on the internet, and they didn't came with some offers. I'm like, oh, that ain't enough. Yeah. Wow. But you ain't getting that Adam shit. You rather bro. see that, that than to see anything else. So that's about all you could ever get. Yeah. 
Oh, what you mean by that, fam? What you mean? Meaning you ain't gonna damn it. It ain't no street stuff. It ain't nothing like it. Ain't it. never gonna be no street yeah, stuff. So yeah. a little boxing, little, little celebrity boxing remember, match. We, we, are, we all standing citizens. You yeah. got you you to hey, fight and, you though. And you gotta yeah. drop down in weight, nigga. <laughs> you can't go in there bigger than this, nigga. You gotta. This is a weight class. So you say he gotta drop weight. Get out. They gotta people, meet. They gotta people meet. People be looking at me on the internet. They think I'm way smaller. No, nah, nigga, you gotta drop down in weight. You know what I'm saying, my nigga? These niggas saying just stop eating, nigga. Yeah, he gonna eat. Yeah, 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 I'm not gonna lie to you. I, man, I damn near put some money on goddamn Shaq, man. I damn near put some money on Shaq. Hey, pull up, man. Get your chair. Hey, get your chair. Get the chair. Get your chair, nigga. Get the chair. Get your 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 chair. He was waiting to say something, man. He was waiting to say something. 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 Money Moses just pulled up. Hey, he was waiting. Yeah. Yeah. He came and shot the hey. king's chair. He yeah. was he talking. He said, "If he would have won, <laughs> if he would have won, talk to me, man." <laughs> no, I mean, like, like, so you seen the you seen the fight? Uh, Money Moses done pulled up. Salute so I mean, my nigga, Money Moses. <laughs> yeah, Money hey, Moses. Hey, 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 listen, man, man, listen, man. man. <laughs> listen, man. These are not the thoughts of our viewers. You know how the how the commercial come out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Money Moses said, "Come on, Money Moses, my." When Pimp C was on, they say don't blame it on the on, yeah. on, but blame Bun. it on the pimp. Yeah. You know uh, what I'm saying? What Bun be doing? That's him. I'm but rocking with 50 percent of this shit. Though. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm, oh, you I'm rocking with some of this he shit. He ain't even saying that. I know where you're going. I know where you're going. I ain't know. I ain't know. Not to let him get on the ball. I know where you're going with this shit. That's why that shit was there though. You can see it. Say, let's go, man. He trying to get some views. Nigga, good shit. No, look. I can put him on here every day and get views on me. No, I'm not doing it. Just don't do it. Oh, yeah, 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 don't do it. You see him with me, right? You see him with me, right? You don't put him on every show. I see, I see. Because we know this nigga ain't going to be one of the boxes anyway. What? I've been with the boss, man. I'm going to ask you about it. I'm with your brother. Who you want to box? Remember that nigga made me on his show? Who I called you about the name of the nigga. Oh, we got to do this. Don't show no nigga on there. No, no, no. Okay, well, anyway, because he, he came at you about some bullshit. No, nah, just let it go, man. I let it go. Man. I get it. I get so. it. I, I, I know that nigga at, fam. Well, I know he, I know he at, nigga in Atlanta. I'm, I, we, 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 no, we're not doing nothing, man. I don't know. I'm not doing nothing. 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 I understand it. <laughs> he, still, uh, he, he still said black podcast, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah black podcast. <laughs> hey, but it makes sense now, though. Yeah. Well, I, but, he, but he showed us love during that time. I got to say that. I still say the mother nigga would not try to let us make it. House phone, House phone might end up back on No Jumper, man, because he, he really... Nah, he ain't. Man, I'm serious. He's been really shooting for him. He didn't shoot nah, for him. Nah, he ain't going to do that. He, he was ain't. shooting for him. He'd be like, he could come back. I, I could hear it at that bootleg camera. Yeah, he's fat nigga going back. He fat nigga going home. I don't think... I don't he know if he will. Had a, he, had a, he, just had a, he just had a pop-up yesterday, man. He doing really? good with the shoes. What, yeah. He doing the shoes? High rollers, yeah. He doing his thing. Wow. So you think he'd be willing to give me a boss talk? A one on one interview. Sure. I, I definitely would like bro, to Bro, he, he a good guy, bro. He yeah. not confrontational at all. I, so he, I, I, you I know what I'm tell, saying? I could tell he was a good one. No, you, you was the one I was watching. Tell. I'm
it on the social shit, media. Yeah. 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 You a nerd, nigga. I'm a nerd. That's what I'm saying. I'm a nerd. We know how to operate the cameras and do all that shit. Look at me. I'm a nerd. I ain't nerd. That's cool now, nigga. No, no. I'm. I want to be one though. I need to get to that route, bro. He never hey, gonna agree with I'm just, I'm trying to. If you ain't never watch the show, Money Mo's never agree with nothing nobody, nobody say. But you what, need for somebody to know. That's what like that, he is. For what reason? If everybody agree on the shit, it ain't gonna make it. He is not gonna agree. Listen, this is your wild card right here. I'm about to put them all in. It's raining outside. When you wanna say something, when you wanna say something that you can't say, Hey, Mo, talk about no, this I'm shit. Get on here. Saying, say, fuck them niggas. I can't say that. Oh, yeah. You feel me? What you gonna do? Hey, white thing I ain't never gonna lie. I'm saying nothing about nobody. Nah, I won't let him. You should you know know. that. I won't let him. I, I tell him don't do it. I made him get off yourself. I made him get off. Hey, yeah, yeah. I made him get off. Don't listen to me then. If it's that bad, I got him off of his show. No, I'm not going to do it. Do not want to get demonetized. Exactly. That's the word. That nigga's that nigga's a red, a yellow dollar sign waiting to happen. You see that more pressure? Yellow dollar sign. Whatever. They demonetize. You demonetize. They whole shit. Yeah. What they do? I don't. Nobody actually knows, but. They took took them out the uh, partnership program, so they can't get paid from YouTube at all. Yeah. What did and they, they do? was and they was the top ten uh, most super chats in the United States when it came down to YouTube. Mm. What the hell did they do though? What does they what does they like show? Like forty fifty thousand in super chats what a month fuck? type oh, shit, yeah. and they cut that water, bro. So yeah. you gotta watch to a certain degree. So they can't what get you can. back. They can't come back. I don't know, but I know it take like. 90 days to appeal and you it still gotta be, wait. They might be able to come back, but it's go, you know what I mean? It's, it's just still iffy because you don't know what the if you don't know what they kicked you off this motherfucker for in the first place, then it's just, man. It's always a, a, a gray cloud. You yeah. don't know how to get through. You can't call nobody on YouTube. Yeah. You can't get, you be trying to figure out Bro, how I to get through. Some you shit send on YouTube a, to you send a screenshot yeah. to say, hey, man, I'm okay. You don't never get to talk to nobody. They you gotta have an insight. Yes. They say go to Twitter. They say if you go to Twitter and send some kind of link or some shit. I ain't heard from nobody, nigga. I ain't heard from a motherfucker. YouTube. I ain't never. Have you ever heard some, from somebody? At YouTube? Yeah. I mean, I got a rep. Now, yeah, now, but I'm yeah. saying like when you was just out here in this cloudy space, hell no, you're like nah, trying to nigga, figure nah, it out. Nah, your nigga. shit get taken, your shit just get taken. It's just gone, bro. Ain't nothing wow. you can do. Gone, man. So how important? How did you learn to maneuver around? To, is it? How did you learn to get that rip? How did you learn how to m deal with these social media platforms, bro? Just you can see, you see by example, they niggas getting axed out every single day yeah, for yeah. having an opinion. Yeah, mm. it may be an opinion that's that's radical. You know what I'm saying? It may sound crazy, but like it ain't no freedom of speech when it I comes down to the shit. We ain't got freedom so of it's speech. none. We never yeah. hate it. But we, never we on hate we it. on private platforms. That's what people t they don't understand. We're on these private platforms. We can't say what the fuck we want to say. If it doesn't align with the people who own the shit, they get you the fuck off. This is my platform, nigga. Fuck you. Yeah. Huh. Have you? Do you feel like that? Have you ever felt like okay, I can't say nothing about this person because if I do, I, they probably can call up there. Nah, I yeah. know. Oh, I'm thinking about I'm it. I'm being real. Think about it. No, nah, there's some people that no, can no, call it, somebody. There's somebody that can yeah. call somebody. Like TD Jakes, nigga. Like, yeah. like, <laughs> like, I, 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 I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> my partner told me whitelisted or whatever. They can get you like, like they can. Oh no, they can do that. Like, what is that about? People play dirty when it come down to that too. Yeah. Yeah. What is that? So basically, like that's like if you if you re react to my content, I can sit there and give you a strike if I want to. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. People do shit like that. Like if I say something about your content and I no no if you like use my content reaction. on your platform reaction video, but I can't. Yeah, but but as long as I don't so put reaction, your whole video up and my video got to be up there with it's it, right? A, it's a nah. It's a weird thing. Like you own. Okay, so basically, the academic do this every day, bro. So you could do this. You could do this, right? Let's say right now you react to some of my shit. I can claim this shit to get all the money to me, basically. Okay, but academics react to people's stuff every day. Bro. Well, I mean, look at, look at now, too. Like, a lot of the labels, you see what they I'm will saying? whitelist people's channels so they can react to it. So if you don't get it whitelisted, you can get some channels, uh, you can get some channel strikes and shit like that, too. Yeah. So it's a dirty game. So let's just say right now, use five or six of my pieces. I technically can go tell my rep, like, hey, he's been using my shit without my consent. Yeah. And they'll strike, 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 strike. So that's how some of these people play dirty games to get you off of YouTube as well, too. Yeah, you can't use you the nigga face, it. the nigga voice. You could, you could put a nigga on your thumbnail and nigga go strike your shit. I learned that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Man, nigga, yeah. You put a nigga that's on what I'm saying. Yeah. So people play a dirty game. 
They'll play dirty games. They oh, want to yeah. get you out of here. Oh yeah! Wow, this oh, yeah. is crazy. Oh, man. nigga, told my ass up on oh, YouTube before. Right? Yeah. See, they got me. I'm finna go strike. Well, they damn sure yeah. got my face. Yeah. Every. You Mine remember too. that you got me in a lot of crap. Oh, I'm gonna get you. Yo, you meet you some shit. You gonna you gonna laugh him, but they gonna be like, you was on there with that nigga. That nigga. They gonna say some crazy. You gonna be like, what? Man, is it that bad? I promise, bro. It's bad. It's that bad. Yeah, it is, bro. If you say it's bad, his show will get you in trouble. You gonna see? His show will get you in trouble. Especially if you're a high Because you, you, you don't talk get back trouble, to bro. people, you know what I mean? You'll but, say yeah, whatever. Well, no, but are they, are they there in person, though? Nah, over the internet. Yeah, yeah, they be there. Right. They be okay, there. look. It's different if it's in person. If it's on the internet, I know. It's not in person, bro. If a nigga say, fuck you, you bet your ass nigga on the internet, oh, that's cool. Nah, he's We got the Discord, we got that shit, you know what I'm saying? Now, if it's in person, I'm just gonna get cracked. Right, right. You know, not, 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 I ain't let a nigga talk to me. Not crack. Not crack. Not nobody ain't letting nobody hear. That's what I'm saying. I'm thinking like, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, nah, nigga, nah. What do you think these people that be in these comments says that boy, they probably ain't got, and they don't have nothing but zero. They have zero body. But they fans too, though. They fans. They come back. They were Carlos Miller saying. They like, give me a bitch. You know, you know, you know how many times, you know how many times somebody DM me, nigga, fuck you. I write back, nigga, fuck you too, nigga. Oh, thank you. That's what I do. I just want a screenshot. I love you, I love you. You gotta, to you. Bro, bro, you gotta play with this shit because at the end of the day, like, you're not gonna run into these motherfuckers. No. Or if they do see you, they gonna shake they gonna, on a pitch. Or, yeah. or they gonna be like, or they gonna stare. Yeah. Like, yeah. nah, bro, it's just all it's all love though. So it's all love. Because so, even my barber came to my episode last week and he was like, man, they was talking bad about me. They was going crazy. I said, nigga, watch in the morning, you gonna feel different about it. He called me when I was on the plane today. He was like, hey, I wanna come back next week. Yeah. Because he looked back and seen, like, I'm like, bro, that's what they do, nigga. Yeah. If they don't rip you up, my nigga, if they can't laugh with you, like, nigga. Yeah. It's, they, they so, got, really, it's all love, it's, my it's nigga. Love. It's all love. That's how I look at it, too. It's, it's all, all love. love. We be in there cutting up and shit. But then the day it's all love. And I do got a couple of bloggers that want to hear. You know what I mean? But at the end of the day, nah, with the, with, with the subscribers yeah. and the people in the chat, it's <laughs> all love. Man. It's not love, love to me, bro. It's, 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 love. it's all love. You know, talk crazy and think I'm not gonna turn them back to you, bro. I just can't even look at you. <laughs> but that's the I difference, bro. You know how many times a nigga will say some shit online? You see him in 3D, nigga be, hey, buddy. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. That's not me though. I'm gonna say yeah. something. No, you supposed to. <laughs> but you so, really what I'm saying is, if a nigga, that's if a nigga say fuck you and he comes sit next to you, he ain't gonna say that shit. No, he not. You ain't gonna. You can't say nothing on the internet that comes sit outside me, bro. Not bro. I'm gonna say them to you. We gotta use my man, my nigga. I'm gonna have to, bro. 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 you. You gotta check that temperature, though. You got to. Yeah. So look, but I. I get a whole bunch of joy when I see a nigga and I shake his hand, you good? You look at him, nigga like, yeah, I'm good. All right, I'm good. I'm good. I ain't gotta do nothing else. <laughs> nah, you just show me. Cause I know what's up. Cause if it's yeah. cracking, you gonna get cracking right there. Yeah. Then I can yeah. go back home, you say something else, the next time I see you, I'm gonna slap the shit out of you. <laughs> Moses says, I'm doing the first time. I'm doing the first time, that way we gonna know what's going on, bro. Cause if you leave and talk shit, then I'm gonna leave you alone then. Moses, I'm gonna leave you alone after, the first time. Wow, yeah. so I'm I'm definitely gonna be uh man I'm I'm checking y'all out man I'm pulling up in L A I'm coming to see you yeah you gotta come I bro got to, I'm man. like I said yeah, I, I usually been I made that trip but I had so much going on I couldn't get to L A yeah last really, time I came I was in all blue ready for yeah. whatever yeah this nigga crazy man <laughs> I'm ready for whatever I bro promise you listen we was at Inglewood why was y'all Inglewood wearing all blue we was in Inglewood at the Roscoe Chicken and Waffles it was that one is cool though. No. Yeah, no, he jumped he, he told me. He told me, like, bro, go on the freeway. I said, nigga, go change clothes. clothes. Put said, something else good. on, bro. You out here blazing blue. You ain't even crazy. So look, look. The, the, <laughs> colors, <laughs> the colors ain't really the problem. It's the hats. If you wear a certain hat, uh, but yeah. it's then it's going to be, you feel me? Bro, we can't wear a Kansas City fit. That's what bro, I'm saying. But, but his attitude is what really is the problem. He jumps out like, nigga, what's up, nigga? <laughs> Where they at? I'm I'm like, this nigga crazy. He's like, man, nigga. I'm not doing this. Why you feel like you had to do that though? Cause he didn't hurt, watch colors or something. No, 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 no,
So it's like me. I'm Nobody ain't looking for this nigga. Nobody care. Yeah, Ross goes too. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like eight bunch of niggas standing over there. Bunch of niggas standing outside. Everybody trying to get their meal. I didn't know my first time down there, so I didn't know where I was. I was just going. What did you think of the city when you went down there? though? Man, it's 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 it wasn't no. Like me chilling, it was just like it's a business. So yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You, you got in, you yeah. got to got up. But like I say, you can go anywhere. If you looking for that shit, you gonna find it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You get what I'm yeah. saying? If you yeah. go looking for it, but bro, you come have a good time. You can have a good time anywhere, man. Yeah. Yeah. I had a good time though. I bro, just yeah, I a couple of times. Y'all gotta time. come out Great there. Y'all yeah. come out there with me. Oh, stay for a couple of days. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna show y'all like the real LA. Take y'all to all the spots and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? And see the people. I gotta ask you about this. I'm a blue sign. I quit. <laughs> Black crow. What? What about see checking in is something else. Ain't man. nothing wrong with checking in. But, I tell niggas that all the time. But, but I see certain niggas like I know it was was Rizzo. They one make of it my sound partners, bad. He got robbed out there. I think for his necklace. That was Chicago. Was Rizzo, he in Chicago? Chicago, Chicago, Rizzo, Chicago. Rizzo, Rizzo, I believe. Yeah. No, I thought it was LA, Chicago. Yeah, I think it was right. If I'm correct, Rizzo got robbed. I'm just trying to figure out what he said. I'm watching everybody. You talking about Sauce Walker partner? Sauce Walker partner. I interviewed him. And somebody done robbed him. I said, "Why is he here?" You could be robbed. I got to do my research. I'm not for sure. I thought he was here. Let me tell you something. How you hear that? You check in. There's nothing wrong with checking. That's like that's like. Look, I come to Dallas for the first time. Yeah. I don't know nobody. You feel me? I do know people, but I'm saying if I don't know somebody, right? If I don't know nobody and I want to go to the club, I want to go to all the spots, I want to go do this, I want to go do that, nigga, I love to be like, hey, Hey, what's up, bro? What's going on? Oh, look, I got you. You gonna hang with my people and do that's that shit. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. When y'all come to LA, hey, bro, I'm we in LA. All right, cool. I'm gonna have my homie. Even if I'm not there, I'm gonna have some people with you. So make sure you good and you can yeah. move around. There ain't nothing wrong with that. That's smart. That's smart. Everywhere I go, I, I got a squad it. somewhere. I call people. Hey, woo, woo, woo. Shout out to my guy Ball too, man. Yeah, you so feel me? Yeah. I've been doing Ball a long yeah, time, bro. But I'm telling you, I, I called. Even a day, like I was like, where these niggas at, man? I called yeah. a couple of DJs. I said, where these niggas performing? I don't see nothing where no damn body performing at. So I called the DJs. They said they ain't trying to figure that shit out, see? Just so I can make sure everybody good. This is Spanish shit. Yeah. Uh, it, it had to be because I couldn't find this shit for nothing, bro. Shout out to my nigga Trill, man. We, That's we hard. Had, so yeah, bro. We... Bro, we got a lot of homies from Dallas we've been fucking with for a long time. Long time. So every time, that's what I'm saying, Ball and Body, when niggas come to L.A., bro, they at home. They always you feel me? I've been knowing Ball over 20 years, man. Yeah, he him and that, uh, he know he's going to see this dirty, hairy gun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, got, he got the oldest gun in the, in, in the books, you feel yeah, me? That long you can't protect nobody <laughs> with that, that, that old musket, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm like, I don't want that when I come out here, man. And man. I, nigga, hand you that motherfucking safe, nigga. You yeah, good. man, that shit all rusty and shit, motherfucker. I got your back. I'm like, no, I ain't got <laughs> this is not gonna work. <laughs> Hold on to this nigga. Man, thank you, man. I'm gonna be real, man. I appreciate you for coming on the show. Oh, anytime, bro. How can people lock in? Which I gotta say that that's one of the things we say on here. Like, how can they get a hold of you? Yeah, man. Everything. I I T S A D, man. Follow the pages. Community. Uh, back on Fig. Ace Boys. Ladies Night. Apollo. Duno's World, man. Fig Muni World. We out here, man. Yeah, I'm coming out there. Them, them low riders still riding out there. Y'all don't miss See, look, that's, a, that's what everybody uh, think. Yeah, hey, yeah, y'all no, got no low riders. Do, but they do. Hey, low riders. No, no, they do like... like I do old cars, nigga. If y'all nah. I'm not coming back on out there. On Sundays. You the low riders? I love on the low Sundays, riders. On Sundays, like Wiz and, and, and Dr. Yeah. Dre and Ty and everybody, they bring their low riders out and they do that shit. There's it's some low-key dope shit, though, yeah. in the city. You got... You and, me, do you and Wiz got any music together? A lot of music. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's my, that's my bro right there, like, man. Like, like, I was going to ask you about that because I was doing my research. I said, this nigga got music with Wiz for. Yeah, that's my nigga. You got music with everybody. Look, he said Wiz too. Piggy be still a name and shit by him. Make sure. This nigga money most crazy. I had to make sure, bro. I'm like, nigga, what Wiz did you think I said? No, I had to make sure. He was like, Wiz who? Wiz? He ain't beefing with a nigga or something? I got to understand. Wiz, I got to name. Everybody got a name. Everybody got a name. That's Money Moses. But Wiz Khalifa, how was it working with him? I'm going to ask you that before. That's the last thing I'm going to get you. Man, bro, you know, just... Cushion Orange Juice is probably one of my favorite mixtapes and shit like that ever, okay. bro. And this is why I tell a lot of artists as well, too, bro. Like, you got to network because you never know who's watching you. Okay. And I remember the first time I randomly went to the to the bowling alley. Wiz was there. I introduced myself. He was like, oh, yeah, I know you is. I like your um your album when you got the lowrider and shit. I was like, oh, shit. Like, that blew my mind. Wow. And then since then, bro, it's been like a brother to me. You feel me? Whenever I need him, you know what I'm saying? He look out for me. Whenever he call me, I'm there. That's, that's yeah. my nigga. Wow. Yeah. Man, hey man, I can't wait to see you hit that meal ticket. 
You know what I'm saying? We hit that We gonna do it a couple of times. We go. Oh, we hitting that meal ticket. Maybe a hundred times. We we ringing the bell, nigga. Nah, we gonna ring the bell for sure. Nah, real shit. For sure. But even that, I don't want a million. I want a billion views. Come on, man. You feel me? Hey, man. So, so what's up, man? Did we get everything? Man, nigga, uh, shit. I mean, it looked like it. Uh, I mean, sh- Money Moses pulled up, and he died. Damn, once that nigga pull up, shit, nigga. Man, we couldn't even get no order <laughs> after damn, Money Moses pulled up because he don't let it be order, man. Uh, nigga, it's <laughs> never no order around, bro. This nigga Money Moses, man. He, he said, won't even send it front of me. Look how he said him front of me. I ain't got it. Look, he won't send it front of me. I can't listen. He said right outside me. He's beating me, bro. He's a big nigga. Hey, I gotta lean up or something. No, I'm tripping how he go to Ross. He said I'm ready for whatever. What nigga ready for whatever? Looking for you, man. Bro, <laughs> bro, I told him I'm not going with you and all that blue, man. Hey, like you got blue hey, top, probably, blue shoes. It's probably some real clowns, my nigga. That they're sitting here writing you too. You know what I mean? Like that shit crazy, bro. But no, but that's the thing too. Like that that chat. That yeah. DMs, that'll get motherfuckers, bro. Oh, man, it'll yeah, yeah. get, it, it, it get you. I, he, we used to show up to him, me. he looking at like, oh, no. Nah. It got you, nigga, if you hopped out. Nah, nah, bro. No, 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 it, it didn't get me. <laughs> it didn't get me. That just me, Bro. That just he me, though. He everybody in the comments. That just I, me. One guy to stop him. Everybody That's my go, job, boom, 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 boom. That didn't get my job to argue with the camera. Bro, it was a crazy not coming, so. Hey, no, that's like my homeboy. He got a restaurant, right? Shit. He argued with the people on his Yelp reviews. Yeah, he got five stars, four stars. Yeah, yeah, he tripping. He tripping <laughs> Like that shit's amazing I mean look It's entertainment man mm-hmm. Everywhere You feel me Everywhere if that's, if that's what he do Nigga make a show About doing that That'll be hard See Ain't nobody got, done that The disagree with Money Moses The disagreement with Money Moses Number disagreement Yeah disagreement Carlos Miller What did Carlos call you The disagreement Man Moses Nigga Carlos Miller You nigga was mad The whole time Carlos Miller Carlos like This nigga mad <laughs> that's what dope content is. Just who, it's who the fuck you are. That's what dope content is. Just who you really are. My See, but, I, you really but I can tell this is really him. Yeah, just oh, really yeah. Him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Monetize that shit. You know what that's what it's about. Like, you would have you know, watched hey, yourself hopping out. Bro, bro. watch that shit. Call up, man. Oh, that nigga lost his mind. Say, man, that nigga, if y'all want to get your pussy beat up, man, get with me. He mad, man. Most. I'm like, what the fuck? The show going crazy bro, now, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Say, man, thank you guys for coming on the show, man. Salute, man. baby. Salute, man. Let's go, go gang. Show, man. Show, man. A boss talk one on one. Bosses talk. Oh, my man. God.